Hey everybody, it's Kim, and I'm going to use you as my mirror. I'm looking a little rough. It's the end of my day. <laughs> so, <laughs> I had a nice sweater on, but I was like, no, nope, I'm getting cozy. Getting comfy and cozy. So there you go. Let's get started. So I did see my doctor yesterday, or talked to her on the phone. We actually did, a, and um, she was saying, well, yes, you have arthritis in your back, remember? And I'm like, well, yeah, but what does that have to do with my hands? She goes, well, it spreads. I have degenerative, I think it's very common, arthritis. So she's feeling like that's, but there, she's going to do blood tests and check my thyroid as well. So there you go. It's been pretty good until yesterday. Sorry, I started right in with stories. <laughs> Like I said, oh my God, I got hair poking up. <laughs> Anywho, you're all friends, right? Um, so yesterday, I've, I decided to get the Omaha steaks. I got them for my kids. And I was like, you know, with the price of meat going up, I'm going to lock in on a price now. They're very, you know, they're not cheap. But it's perfect for me. I can go out there. Plus, I get my meals from home chefs. So between the two, I'm covered. I, Anyway, so I had out a steak knife is where I'm going, and I, but I didn't cut myself cutting my steak. It was very nice. It was a good steak, but I needed olive oil, new bottle open, and they have that seal around there. Well, usually it has a little, I couldn't find the tap. So I'm going like this with the steak knife, right? Boof, right into my hand. <laughs> so I can't like grip cups and stuff. It was a puncture wound, but it was small, but it was deep. So no blood spurted. So I figured I didn't need to go to the emergency. <laughs> I mean, I thought, okay, this is another reason. It's kind of scary sometimes to live by yourself. And yeah, my son lives close by, but he has classes in Seattle on Tuesdays. And I was just like, oh my God. And I was fine. And it actually, it's just when I try to use, I didn't lose any, I didn't cut a tendon or anything. It's just, you know, that act of gripping. So there you go. I'm going to be okay. I'm just, I mean, I should know better. I know better than to go like that with a steak. Now, I mean, anyway, okay. I was just getting really frustrated with that olive oil bottle. bottle. Yeah, so I paid for it. Okay, so I have done a little shopping here and there, and I did go to some thrift stores, different ones, and I found this. I thought this was clever. Sorry, I flashed it in front of me, and then I grabbed it away. They put it in this Driscoll's box. It's just a berry box. Well, that works. Plastic box. And it had all these snowmen. Maybe I'll go like this. Cute. What does it say? Christmas is on its way. So it's definitely a Christmas one. I don't have, it doesn't say a name brand or anything. Cute. So that came in the set. $4.99 for all of these, so that's good. Happy holidays. So these are definitely Christmas. But this one, somebody labeled it the feature stamp. Let me look. I don't know if they covered up the brand. It's so funny. I get rid of these things and now I'm getting them again. Silly. Great Impression Centralia, Washington. I think that's adorable. <laughs> Looks like three buddies out hanging in the snow. There's that one. This little guy, pretty small. I think this is Hero Arts. Snowman with broom. Hero Arts, yes, 1990. Oh, jeez. Okay. Oh, my God. All right. So, and a little candy cane. She did tell me to not. I've been doing ibuprofen and Tylenol. She goes, do not do ibuprofen all the time because it's really bad on your insides. So, okay, okay. But, um that some people like glucosamine. So this is just, I'm just telling you this in case you're going through this, but she says it takes about three months for it to build up. So don't expect immediate reaction. So I actually have a big bottle from Costco of, because I had tried it a while back. I knew I had the arthritis in my back, but you know, I didn't think it meant my hands. Decaf. Okay. Somebody asked, and I keep forgetting to go and look, about what brand these watercolor paints were. 
And this is a called, they're called White Box. Mon Ami watercolor. Mon, M-O-N, Ami, A-M-I, White Box. So hopefully you see this. I'll try to remember to respond if I don't. Then I got yesterday, I went and got to another Goodwill and I found this. Ow, see, if I... <laughs> The big dog. I'm so mad at myself. Letting that bottle win. I'm just glad I didn't hit a vein or something. That would be embarrassing. See, it's I, I'm like Lucille Ball. Anywho, isn't he cute? He's got a little hat on, flamingo. But and I don't. And this one is by. I don't know. Doesn't say. This is a Stampin' Up though. Look at this guy. Happy bird day. So my one daughter-in-law loves flamingos. So I'll try to remember that I have that. And where I put it. Sheesh. And I almost didn't get this one. It was $3.99. But I thought, you know, that's a nice for cards. A frame. Rubber die. Obviously. $3.99. Sorry about the glare. I've got the light thingy on because it's dark. Anita's. From Georgia, Anita's. Guadalupe. And they put their name on. Anyway, here we go. Not pretty. And this one was there last time, and I didn't get it. And I thought, you know, I like this. Look at these birds. It is beat up. But that doesn't, Im don't let that deter you, because it doesn't change the stamping of it. I can clean it, but I probably won't, to be honest. Happiness is sharing a dream. Look at those little lovebirds. Oh my gosh. And who is this by? Stamps Happen. Fullerton, California. Stamp Happen, stampshappen.com. I don't know if they're around anymore. Originally $12 back in God knows when. So it was, um, what am I going to say? $3.99. My principal came in today and goes, how's it going? She had to talk to me about something. I'm always like, she never comes in my room, which is fine. She's a busy woman. I'm not saying that. But uh, when she does, I'm like, oh boy, what's going on? What does she want? Anyway, and I was like, you don't want it. I'm in between two autistic rooms and I get it that they make noise in there, but to be in between the two rooms... And they have a buzzer on the one room because the kids run out and that thing is going and my kids can't concentrate. Margaret and I are just like, by the end of the day, my nerves are frazzled. I just, you know, we're packed to the gills. So I'm not going to get to move anywhere, but it's like, oh my gosh. I'm always whining, but yeah, I gave her a look like, you know, I said I probably shouldn't answer that question, right? I'm tired. Report cards are due. Holy moly. Anywho, so I did end up venturing out to Hobby Lobby. And let me tell you, they're starting to clearance, people. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Warning, warning. So just a little bit. I found some in the stationary part. I almost didn't get these. Answer below if you know, can you mail square cards for the same price you mail a regular a, what are they, A2 cards? $249. So yeah, the, let the clearancing begin. So while I was there, these were on 30 I think, off. And people, I think, have different people have noticed, said that these are good. The Tulip, they're puff paints. Well, they have one with glitter. I didn't know that was even a possibility. So you may say glitter to me, and I'm on it. And then I got the matte. $5.49 and then this week 30% off tulip products and paints. So just to do that dimensional thing. Oh, I wanted to show you this. I'm so excited. Oh my god. I got this off Facebook Marketplace and I think she spray painted it herself now that I'm looking closely. The seller. Yeah, she did. Anyway, it's teal. You say teal to me. And I've been wanting a place to display my some of my, now I can't get all my wood blocks, and some of them are too big, but I can put them, they will fit in here, right? And if I see them, I'll use them. So I'm just going to put, like, my current ones or the ones I want to use and remember on here. I'm, ow, sorry, hanging on the wall. 
Cute, cute, and more cute. I think it's supposed to be a spice rack, but you know, you know how us crafters are. We don't use things for what they're intended for. So I paid 15 for that, so not bad, not bad. Um, she had just posted it, and because I was off yesterday, I was able to meet her. Because sometimes if you say, I'll get it this evening, then they sell it to somebody else and you're out. What else? Oh, the hobby in the lobby. So I've been wanting another tear tray. I'm not... I'm getting kind of tired of the, I decided on my kitchen one, I put a little lamp, I point over there like you can see it. I have that tall one usually, and I'll probably use it off and on. But right now I have a Pioneer Woman lamp with a lampshade, a little gnome, and a plant. And I think it looks cute. So this is to go on my coffee table. I don't know what it is, but they're so expensive. Tiered trays, you would think that they are made out of gold. So this, they have their tiered tray tabletop things are 50% off, but I got this, didn't like those ones. I don't want it, I wanted a bigger shelf up here. I liked, this matches my coffee table. Anyway, so I went for the spring thing. So spring shop, $32.99 and 40% off of that. So 12, I don't know, 40 off of 30 would be 12. So, $12 off, you do the math, I'm too tired. So anyway, I really liked this particular one because of the size of the trays. There you go. I'm going to be quiet now. So, I was excited about that. What else did I get there? I something else there. I know I did. Oh, not too much. Again, a little bit of clearance starting. It's starting. It's always between the big seasons, right? So I got this, these paper bags. I think I've had these Saxon things, 74 cents. Got those. And then I got 99 cents envelopes, 12, purple. So I'd have to use a label on these if I mailed them, right? And then 12 piece 5 by 7 cards to match 99 cents, so... Got those. I think I'll probably gift those to my purple loving friends. And let's see what else do I get. Oh, and then I needed a good off white because I've been doing a lot of painting. I share that in another video. I have been busy. I've been crafting. I think that's it from the hobby in the lobby. Yes. So then I went to Michael's because I wanted to. Why did I go there? Oh, I wanted tracing paper. And I got tracing paper there because some of the projects I want to be able to paper piece. This was not on sale. Tracing paper 9 by 12 but I got it with my teacher discount, so I got it for $6.40. And back in my painting days, I would trace things, patterns, and then, you know, or designs or images. And then you, I had to order it. They didn't have it. Um, it's the charcoal. What's it called? I'm sorry. I got it on Amazon, if I remember, I'll list it before below. But anyway, and then you take this, put the charcoal transfer under, and go around with a stylus, and it puts the pattern. So say I want to do them in paper, and I, it, I don't want to, you know, I want to be able to have it right size, I can use that. So I doubt I made any sense there, but there you go. That's why I bought <laughs> You guys are like, okay, Kim, whatever. Shouldn't buy it, but I got some because it's girl- this was on clearance for $5. It's adorables. Dream big, little one. Beautiful girl, because I'm doing two girl calendars. I did start page one, but then I got distracted with painting. And yeah, I can't go from one type of activity. I have to finish. I mean, I have to finish it. I can't pop around. So I don't know. It's a whole thing. So these were $5. And then I got these on clearance. Miss Tori. I mean, sorry, but she just loves orange, so I had to have these. These were on clearance for two. I think that's all from there. This is a long one. Where am I at? 14 minutes. I'm just going to keep going. If you get bored, just turn it on. I'm good. Okay, so I think we can move into my dollar and tree. I love these things, and they brought them back out. So I in my shower... I don't know why I picked this color. It's orange, but whatever. Anyway, I put my shaver in one. Well, I need one. For the, these will hold. I tried. They hold your soap. 
bar of soap. Perfect. It's just suctions to the side of your shower. Boom. And I have them on my coffee maker. I keep my spoon that I stir with in there. Then on the side of my microwave, I have a whole bunch, two of them for pens. Love these things. So, just saying. I don't get commissioned by them, obviously. Let's see, what else? Oh my gosh. Oh, this one's falling apart already. I have to glue it. Is this not the cutest? And it's a light. So I got a couple of them for gifts and one for me. It's got the little light on the inside. I mean, seriously. They have another one that's red in a cup and it says hot cocoa, but I really don't do hot cocoa. I'm a coffee girl. So got that. Then I like my bees, so this will go with my bee theme tray. It says be happy. I did a video last summer, I think it was, of my bee tray. Sorry, I'm facing this way while I talk to you. For this, oh my god, see, right now my back's killing me. But I have no idea why. Anyway, it's just getting old. It really, like my mom used to say, getting old late for sissies. And it sure isn't. So this, I thought these would be pretty. I already decorated it, but I took everything off to show you the tray. Um, so I'm going to put these on there as well. Okay. have these but I got another one seriously I need to be stopped I just think I keep thinking I'm gonna do just a picture inside so I'm putting this I'm, this is I'm gonna do this this week hold me to it okay what else oh online at uh, Allie and my friend um, Judy's where is she I don't know what I did oh here it is Ju oh, Susan's Cutting Dies, but the girl's name is Judy. I don't know. She must have taken it over. It's a Facebook group that you can join. It's a private group, and she sells dies. Now, are they the best price? No, but you don't have to wait five years to get it. Like, I think this was $9, $10, including shipping. I ordered it maybe Monday or no, Monday or Sunday or Monday. Here it is already, so... She's great service, and I just love this slim line with the hearts, and you get a lot of little pieces you can use. So I got that from Judy's, or Susan's Cutting Dice, but like I said, her name is Judy. I don't know. I don't make these things up. It just really is true. So then on um, Alley, some of these, like I need stencils, but they're <laughs> layering stencils, I think. I can blame craft eccentricity Sharon for this, but they're numbered so you can make it into a pattern. I'll try to write down below what shop I got these from. So to look at these this way, it's like big deal, but in, when you see the picture, so there's one, two, three, and it makes us gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Now Sharon did see in this one too. It's got that pattern and they're layered. Used. And I thought, you know, I never think of that. She did a cute little, I think it was a bunny, and behind it she stenciled tulips. I mean, perfect. I gotta do this. I gotta get more like my friend Sharon. And then this one is a layered one. So you get the idea. And then I think they threw this one in because it's not layered and it's just cute stars. So there you go. And they're, I think, six by six. Return to LAX. I don't know what that means. So I don't remember what the shop name is, unless it's this. Which we, this is a small, okay. So they did do the, any questions about the, I don't know. Q-I-T-A-I -I, and they threw in this gift. It says on this card, but again, I will list the shop below because I don't think that's what Almost done. Just some Dollar Tree quick stuff and then we're out of here. Okay. I'm a sip of my poofy thing. All right, really quick. Emma is in the Magic School Bus. This is not Magic School Bus, but she loves to tell me about outer space. This kid is like a, you know, that age and she's such a little sponge. 
So I thought she's going to get into this, our solar system activity book. So I'll read it to her, and as we're reading it, we can fill in the missing stickers. Bon, I'm going to have her over pretty soon. Oh, sorry, Corn. See, you don't get your own bags anymore, so I mix stuff up. So this is Dollar Tree. I'm going to paint him up. I'll try to send, share him. I'm learning you don't want the really detailed ones, but I hadn't found him, and when I found him at a different Dollar Tree. I was like, yeah, baby. So I'm excited about that because he's a gnome and you know me and my gnomes. I wish they had put the nose in there though. Let's see. Okay, I get it. That's why. All right, all right. I'll forgive them. Okay. Dollar Tree. I thought for pictures of the girls, my granddaughter's painting, doing artwork. Wouldn't that be cute? Great artist, create. I love art. Unique. Just to creativity is magic. Yes, it is. Boy, I'm telling you, I love. And I now that I have them home, I don't know what it is. I could look at these in the store and go, nope, never, don't have them. And I get sitting here filming with you guys, and I go, yep, I have it. They are kind of a. They're a sticker, but they're more of a plastic gorgeous so I don't know what that is and I'm don't have pets but I and they had dog ones but they weren't I didn't like them as much these are just cutesy not trying to look like real cats I guess that's why I look and I like the colors and the patterns on them so Got those another one of these gifting some so be careful check the paper but it can always be re-glue but I just that's cool that is really cute. Too cute. Okay, one more thing from the Goodwill. I don't know if this was the best deal. Well, they're normally 30, it says on there. Heartfelt dies for $7.99. I almost didn't get it, but I thought, yeah, I really like them. Of course I do. So I got them. So, okay, that, my friends, is it. It's what does it say? Puscatani Phil says it's going to be six more months of winter, which you all are suffering. We're just, I wanted a, I want a late start snow day, but I don't think we're going to get another snow day. We usually get one or two, maybe. And we got our big one during, here they are. Somebody's used them, which is fine. Cute. And this is what they do, so you can get that trim you know the oh i just love them and i thought you know normally i'd pay i'd pay 7.99 and a heartbeat if they were in a store a regular store so why not so there you go because i need more dyes oh and check out anna white she is so creative i could just she does these where she just colors with music going so relaxing so thank you for doing those Anna but she has a new challenge and when she first Anna when you first announced it I went well I can't do that one sewing themed so it doesn't mean you need to I thought oh I don't sew no it could have a button on it with thread going through I mean she's very you know it's just for fun for a focus so check out Anna White's new uh hashtag challenge thing for the month and so yeah I'm gonna try to do that I don't know how soon I'll get to it, but we'll see. And uh, let's see. I think that's it. Next Monday, I get a root canal. And people, you guys are so sweet. You're all like, it's not that bad. I'm like, okay. But I <laughs> said to the gal, I have to be in a meeting with a parent I've never met that afternoon. So I probably should have an earlier because I don't want it. You know how that big swelling and you can't talk. So she said, yeah, do an earlier one. So that's what I'm doing. Get it out of the way. Get her up done. That's it. I've updated you on my health. Oh, and my dad. He's fine. He doesn't have COVID, you know, anymore. But he's not able to have visitors because the state says if it's in the building, then they can't. It's killing him. That, the loneliness and isolation is not good at 90. It's not good at any age, but 98, you start losing capacity, you know. Just the, uh, I talked to him the other day, and he, he's so funny, he goes... Oh, I'm eating my apple. I go, Dad, I have called you four days in a row, two or three times 
each day and have it gotten through to you. I finally get you on the phone, put the apple down and talk to me for two, give me two minutes. And once I get him past, okay, he says, but he just sounded, didn't sound good at all. I just was like, it's lonely and I can't visit him this weekend. It just breaks my heart, so. Oh, and Melody Lane, I'm just going on and on. You guys are probably like, why is she still talking? I swear this doesn't have caffeine in it, it's just me. Um, it's Kimbo Creations powered talking. She is, and her son, I don't know if you guys follow Melody Lane, she does a lot of cricket and very sweet, colorful person, very colorful. It's got the hick on. Anyway, she has COVID and her son has COVID and they just put, her sister is updating people. I'm on her Facebook group. Her son's maintaining his oxygen level, but they couldn't get, she's in ICU now. She's been there for like a week. And they just ventilate, put her on a ventilator. It's like, oh, God. So they are doing a GoFundMe because they have a lot of bills from this. So prayers for everybody that's going through this. I just want this over. Let's go. Get it over. All right, guys. Take care. And hopefully everybody's healthy and happy. And if you made it to this end of the video, end of this long me rambling, you're awesome. All right. Take care. Bye-bye.